Yo, Kendrick got everybody in their feelings, man. Everybody is popping out and expressing themselves, man, because we all know that Kendrick is um, performing at the halftime show and people are speaking out against it, man. Everybody is so shocked and so surprised that Lil Wayne uh, is not going to be performing at the halftime show. And we got Cameron. We got May speaking out. We got Bootsy speaking out. We got Master P speaking out. Everybody is popping out and expressing themselves. So let's go to this one first. Shout out to Chigs. All right, Chigs. I'm just I'm just gonna put all these videos in one. All right. So let's just get straight into it. This is World of Bone for the Chicks Move channel. We gotta talk about this. If you felt like the rap he would tweet out the picture of the quote saying of Twitter, Jack Dorsey would tweet out quote, big as a Super Bowl, and even Pusha T <laughs> posting on his story, the picture of the quote saying, only one opportunity to win a championship. Boy, everybody's speaking out on this, boy. Everybody's speaking out of this. Pusha T, everybody tweeting about it. This is crazy. No round twos, which he would write, this is true. Shrugging shoulders emoji. As the news of this announcement spread, Lil Wayne's engineer will post on his story, confused, disappointed, mm. angry, but most of all, inspired. We'll never be in a position or have the GOAT in a position where we are at the mercy of someone else's decision. We will make the decisions. Dang, so now we got Lil Wayne speaking out. Well, not Lil Wayne, but Lil Wayne's um, engineer speaking out on the situation. Which is clearly referring to Lil Wayne not being chosen away from Lil Wayne, as opposed to being trying to capitalize mm -hmm. and say about this. As he posts on Instagram saying, salute to Kendrick Lamar for performing at the halftime at the Super Bowl LIX. Well deserved. He's one of the hottest music artists in the world and has one of the biggest songs right now. As ambassador of entertainment in the city of New Orleans, I have to agree with the fans that Lil Wayne should be a part of the celebration as well. He's one of the greatest hip hop artists alive, still relevant, and he's a New Orleans native. Let's not miss the cultural moment in the South. Life is too short. We have to give our legends their flowers while they're still here. Change starts with us. At NFL, at Jay-Z, at now I, I don't I don't disagree with that, but who says that Lil Wayne is not going to be involved? You know, um, the NFL might have him do something else, but you know, uh, you know, it is it is definitely unfortunate, you know. But like I said, who knows? Kendrick might bring out um, Lil Wayne, and you know take the show so but you know hey listen man i'm not mad at kendrick lamar having this moment um he deserves it uh but little wayne is from new orleans uh he deserves it too i mean you can only do so much right like this moment that kendrick lamar is is having is something unseen unheard this moment ain't gonna happen again so you know, you got to take advantage of it. And the Super Bowl is, <laughs> hey, man. <sighs> you know, it is what it is. New Orleans, this was his response. Hey, what you do to the Super Bowl? <laughs> Good, nigga. <laughs> I'm just asking a question, man. I don't know the answer, but I gotta ask you. Of course, the Super Bowl is in New Orleans. Um, I think it's in 2025 or something. Like he that. doing I'm not, it? I'm not sure. Not, I'm not, man, not sure. come on, man. Say it, man. I can. I would not lie to you. I am not having. I got a call. Hey, Jay, <laughs> like come on. Kind of so, Jay. But we all praying. You know, we praying. We keeping our fingers crossed. I'm working hard. I'm gonna make sure this next album and everything I do is killer. Yeah. So I'm gonna make it very hard for them. To, I want to just make it hard for them not to not to pick the boy. So no matter how. No Dang. I kind of do feel bad. Dang, because he said he going to come out with an album and he's going to make it hard for them not to pick him. Ah, oh, damn. I do feel kind of bad. Damn. Wayne is top five all time to me, right? When you when you talk about the GOATs, Wayne's top five, top five. Um, damn, that is kind of messed up. Like, damn. Yeah, this interview is... is uh, is kind of bad because Wayne like, man, I'm going to work hard. I'm going to make good music. I'm going to make a good album. So I'm going to force them to put me at the halftime Super Bowl. Oh, dang. I, I, can, I would not lie to you. I am not having not got a call. Hey, Jay, <laughs> like come on. I'm so, vote, Jay. But we all praying. You know, we praying. We keeping our fingers crossed. I'm working hard. I'm going to make sure this next. Hey, what you do to Super Bowl? <laughs> this was his response. Hey, what you do to Super Bowl? <laughs> <laughs> Good, nigga. I, well, I gotta ask. You gotta, I'm just asking a question, man. I don't know, know the answer, but I gotta ask you. Of course, the Super Bowl is in New Orleans. Um, I think it's in 2025 or something. Like he doing it? I'm not sure. Not, I'm not, man, not sure. come on, man. Say it, sure. Dang. YG saying that he doing it. Oh man, that's 
That yeah, is kind of bad, though. I go cap. His response. Hey, What'd you do to some boy? No, nigga. I, well, I gotta ask. You gotta, I'm just asking a question, man. I know, I know the answer, but I gotta ask you. Of course, the Super Bowl is in New Orleans. Um, I think it's in 2025 or something. Well, like he that. doing I'm not, it? I'm not sure. Not, I'm not, man, I'm not sure. come on, man. Say it, man. Sure you gotta say it, man. I would not lie to you. I am not having. not got a call. Hey, Jay, <laughs> like come on. That. I'm kind of folk. Jay, but we all praying. You know, we praying. We are keeping our fingers crossed. I'm working hard. I'm gonna make sure this next album and everything I do is killer. Yeah. So I'm gonna make it very hard for them. To, I want to just make it hard for them not to not to pick the boy. So no matter how nonchalant Little Wayne is, that still would have been a special moment. Dang. It is kind of messed up. <sighs> well, yeah, you know what? I'm just going to make this as this video. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to make this a, 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 a separate video and just let this be its own separate video. What do y'all think in the comments down below, man? Do you think Lil Wayne should have been chosen? You know, uh, I don't know, man. Um you know, Wayne is from New Orleans and he is a legend. He has multiple class, classic albums, multiple hits from all different type of styles. But man, Kendrick is on the wave like none other, man. And, and Kendrick currently is making music that is currently hitting charts, that is currently dominating the streams, you know, so... <sighs> Uh, ooh, I don't know, man. Little Wayne engineer spoke out. He said, confused, disappointed, angry, but most of all, inspired. So, you know, we may get some good Little Wayne music out of this. You know what I mean? This might motivate, you know, and really get Wayne back in that booth and give us a quarter. Well, he is going to bring uh, he is making a new Carter album, but he need to go back to the Carter one and the Carter two. That's the Carters that we enjoy. Well, that's the Carter that I enjoy. Carter one, Carter two. Ooh, classic. So, you know, maybe this might motivate him to, you know, get back to where he was. Not saying that he fell off, but, you know, Prime Wheezy. Ooh, Prime Wheezy was oof. <laughs> his run was was insane, especially with all those mixtapes and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, um, I'm going to do more reactions on other people's uh, reactions. Cameron, I'm going to do a whole nother video because, yeah, I'm just going to make this about Lil Wayne. So y'all leave a comment down below, man. Do you think Lil Wayne should have uh, performed? Do you think they made a mistake? Or do you think Kendrick Lamar deserves it? Y'all leave a comment down below. It's your boy DMD signing out.